Okay, here we are in the next video of today. Please like, please subscribe, never forget to always remember, every time a notification bell rings, the little man gets his wings and you get to see more of my videos. So give me a big thumbs up, hit the red button, hit the red button, and after you subscribe, ring a ding a ling little bell. And don't forget my Patreon either, it's only a dollar. And if I get enough interest in what I'm doing, I shall do more. Now, that is done. I don't expect that we shall be needing that again. So let us discard. Uh, there it is, down there. And we shall go to the next one. For the, the study, that was the kitchen over there. For the study, I think I shall use this, the blue. Hmm. Yeah, don't like that. Well, it does form a pattern, don't it? And it forms pretty much the same pattern on the op on the opposite side. It's not a particularly pleasant pattern. I don't think I will use it. Maybe elsewhere. Let's let's try. Try this one. Hmm. Yeah, I don't like that. Oh, that's the thing. Yeah, you see? It it's the block I don't like. And I think I will get rid of that. So, uh, oh, you go. Now let's try a different one. How about this? No, I think that's more for the parlor. Well, let's go do the parlor then. If we're going to be particular. do it differently here. We need a basis to start with. Okay, I like that. Now. Oh, this was just the, the base. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Still no. Yes. That is the shape we want. Does it do on the see on the opposite side? It does that other pattern. But this is the one I want. Now let's see. Can I get it? No. Yes. All right. Uh, and just like before, we're going to get rid of every other one. Uh-huh. 
Same thing here. See, we I keep those. For the walls of the house itself, I'm going to use a, let's see, oh, th that was wrong. That's why it wouldn't work. Yes. <laughs> oh, I put it in the wrong slot. For the walls, I'm going to use the, uh, the stripped, uh, stripped bark uh, wood pieces. I'm not exactly sure yet how I'm going to use them, but that's what I'm going to do. The plan will go ahead as planned. So I did my uh, Second Life videos uh, yesterday, and I uploaded them, so they would will be there for you. Uh, I ask you, I beg with you, I plead with you to watch my Second Life videos, because they're fun. Mother and father mess around a little bit, nothing serious, mind you, but they... <laughs> have a lot of fun and uh, they look very pretty doing it. Now let's see, how about you? Oh, no, that's not right. How about you? Yes, that works. So, these disappear. Just cut out the ones that don't fit your pattern. Oops. I think I'm going to have more chimneys like that. I didn't want that. I like that chimney. It'll go nicely with the uh, with the wood. Um, for the basement stairs, I I did them in the uh, polished granite. And so what did I use? Here. Polished granite. That's right. And I did the uh, the floors of the closets and so forth in polished granite. Okay, let's 
escape from there. Yeah, this would be this would be nice with these. Uh, I mean, f for the parlor. So that's my trick of dealing with. Uh, with this class of blocks. The glazed terracotta. You find the right angle that will suit your pattern, and you, est you establish the pattern by going first one direction, then the other, until you figure out a pattern that's going to work. Then you go on like this until you've uh, you build them up in the pattern of your choice. Huh? Okay, now let's see. Oh, that worked. Yeah, it worked nicely. Uh huh. Yes. A lot. It gets easier as you build up blocks because you have. Uh oh. Which way did we go? So, was this it? Nope, that wasn't it. Maybe it's. It, yeah, it's from here. Uh huh. I think the hardest thing about doing this is not to lose your place. for the last one that way isn't that marvelous I am very happy with that I'm going to be using glazed terracotta more often now, uh, just as soon as my fingers stop falling.